along and do a bit of a reminder about my mini make along which will be closing soon scrap timber au and launch my october mini make along because yes i've decided i will do another make along in october just a mini one so scrap timber au today is the 29th of september and it closes tomorrow on the 30th of september 11 59 pm eastern standard time australia Make sure you've got your entries in if you wish to participate in the prize draw. There is a participant prize draw. First person out will win a $25 gift voucher. Second and third will win either a $10 gift voucher or a $10 pattern prize. Entirely up to them. The prize draw will be sometime on the 1st of October when I upload the video of the prize draw. So don't forget, post your pictures with the hashtag scrap timber au or email me your pictures there you have it september is nearly over and october is around the corner i can't believe this year it's flying fast so while i was away i thought about this mini uh, make along for october i have done it before a couple of years ago and october always me makes me think of this nationally we celebrate pink october which is Breast Cancer Awareness Month. And there are lots of different fundraising activities and lots of different charities wanting you to fundraise for them. I personally will be fundraising for a local cancer wellness centre, not necessarily just breast cancer or cancer. But let's get back to my October make-along. Hashtag Pink October AU. Yes, another Pink October AU. So... With October fast approaching and Christmas around the corner, I thought we could do something in pink before we have to start thinking about those Christmas colours. It's my mini make-along will be open worldwide. You must be 18 years of age and over. YouTube policies apply. All the rules to my make-along will be in the video show notes below this video. Please read them carefully and make sure you fully understand the make along it commences on the 1st of october and closes on the 31st of october 11 59 pm eastern standard time australia and yet again on the 1st of november i will do a participant prize draw video sometime um how do you enter well you make something using the color pink any color pink in a variety of pink here are two I just got out of my yarn stock. This is Ferris wheel, a four weight. This is sent to me by Janice. There's a lot of pink in there. This was a um, candy swirl by Stylecraft. I've had a while. I, obviously, I've used some of it. It's not quite a scrap, but there you go. Any variety that you think is pink will do. I haven't decided what I'm going to make yet. I have lots of different pinks. I have baby pink, uh, four plies. I have all the weights. It just, decide, just depends on what project I decide to make. I won't be a moment. Sorry, my neighbor just came home on his Harley and was revving his motorbike. So the minimum requirement is 75 grams of yarn. Anything you make must be at least 75 grams of yarn. You can use more, but something that takes about 75 grams of yarn will be a nice little project. Any project. Face washes, you can make them as gift. Beanies, you can double dip. You can do a bod had a palooza in pink and double dip and use it in my hashtag for Pink October as well. Triple dip, whatever you're making for something else and you use pink, then by all means, put it in Pink October AU and let's have a lot of entries. All you have to do is post your pictures on Facebook, in the group, hashtag Pink October AU or in Instagram. If you don't do social media, by all means, email them to me and you will go in the participant prize draw. Because yes, there'll be prizes again. A $25 gift voucher and two $10 prizes for second and third. Same as Scrap Timber AU. I will be fundraising for Couch, a local charity. It's a wellness centre that provides real 
outcomes and strives to make a difference in the lives of people who've been affected with cancer. I'll put a link in to the charity in the description below so you can see that it is a bona fide char um, charity that I will be fundraising for. I'll be doing other fundraising locally, but I thought sometimes I get asked by my subscribers, can I donate? How can I help? Well, if you want to support me you can and make a donation, you can go to my Ko-fi page. I'll put a link in the show notes below and buy me a coffee. But make sure you put hashtag Pink October AU so I can put the funds towards the fundraising. That would be awesome. I think I've got the coffee set like at a dollar. So it's entirely up to you. It's just I thought for those who always email me and ask me, yes, you can support my fundraising through my Kofi account. So what you have to do is decide if you're going to join us, what your project will be, and of course, shop your stash. I'm sure everybody would have some sort of pink yarn in their stash to make a project. And let's raise breast cancer awareness and turn October very pink. And uh, let's celebrate Pink October AU. Guys, I hope you take part. It should be a lot of fun. Um, I've I thought I hadn't had a project, but I was looking at my Ravelry list. I might have to buy a pattern and make something funny that might make you all laugh. I hope it doesn't offend people. I did see it today in my wish list and I thought, hmm, I should make that. Anyway, guys, I hope you find an interesting project and jump on board and support Pink October AU. And don't forget, you can double dip with whatever project you're making. making. Um, in a couple of days, I'll launch some videos on the yarn I bought on my travels. I'm not going to do one big long hour episode of all the yarns. I thought I'd break them into the areas I bought them from, like where I started and where I finished, and just show you some of the yarns and things that I bought while I was traveling. Um, just to share them with you and talk about my experiences. Um, I find it interesting when other people do it. So hopefully you will find my content interesting. To those new subscribers, I got a few this week. Welcome. I hope you're enjoying the channel and I look forward to reading all your comments and what you think about Pink October AU. Take care, stay safe and stay well. Until